3, negative 4. Kama wana kama ndika fendera kama kanga na kulasi jira. Awe, I'm almost done here. Okay, what's the last question? It's here. Eh? This is the last question, which is question 23. And this is 6 marks. Okay, 6 marks. Now when you come here, you look at your question. This is the, the speed time what? Speed time graph, eh? Okay. So the question is saying, the diagram shows the speed time graph of a particle. Of a what? Of a particle. The particles starts from rest and from rest here and accelerates uniformly to a speed of 10 meters per second. This huh? in five seconds. In five seconds. It then moves at this constant speed for five seconds. Five right? seconds here. And then accelerates. Okay, so acceleration here is two meters per second square. Squared acceleration this here. For five seconds, yes, it's five seconds here. And and um, oh, to reach the speed of v meters per second, okay, fine. No wonder we've been given acceleration. They want us maybe at some point to be asked to find the value of vi. Uh huh. Yes, it's the second one. The second question B. Okay, so you start solving, eh? Find the acceleration during the first five second, seconds. Here, yeah, this is easy. Acceleration is equal to final velocity minus initial. Velocity over time taken. Are we together? Yes. Uh huh. So acceleration is equal to final velocity is what? 10. Eh? Mm -hmm. Initial here is was what? Zero. Time taken is what? Five. Five. Okay. So A is equal to 10 divided by what? Five. How many times does five go into 10? Okay. Two meters per second squared. This is acceleration. Acceleration I. So we're done with the A. Then let's go to. B. Let's go to what? B. So B, B here, we are told that um, find the value of V, eh? this one, eh? find the value of V. So to find the value of V, check nicely. We are given acceleration here. So since we are given acceleration here, and this is the acceleration from this point up to this point, we're still going to use the formula for acceleration. Acceleration is equal to final velocity minus initial velocity over time t taken. Are we together? Then, what is the, we just have what? Substitute. What is acceleration here? We are told in the question that is what? Two meters per second squared. Eh? So here we're just going to substitute with what? Two. What is the final velocity? It's V. Am I right? Uh-huh. V minus. What is the initial velocity here? It's 10. That's the initial velocity. 10. 10. Over, what is the time taken? 5, right? 5. We cross multi what? Multiply. 1 times this, it will be just V minus 10 is equals to 10. 10. And the 10 will cross the cosine I. That's what we mean with V is equals to 10 plus 10. What is 10 plus 10? 20. What are, what are you calculating? Oh, 20 meters per second squared per second. Eh? This is, is what? Velo, velocity. So we have found the velocity is just 20 meters per second per second. Okay, it's as simple as this. Let's go to the last question, which is three mark. Three marks, right? Okay, the last question. We are asked to find the average speed for the whole journey. Thank you. The average speed for the whole what? Journey. So to find the average speed, guys, average speed is equal to distance covered over time taken. Am I right? Now, time taken, we know that is 15 sec seconds. Do you know distance covered? No. So first, let's find the distance cover, covered. So to find the distance covered here, since we are told that it is for the whole journey, not in the last, let's say, last four seconds, those questions that they usually ask, eh? Uh huh. Now here, we are going to calculate the total dista distance. And the easiest way is look at the shapes involved. Shapes what? Involved. We have two trapezium. I can see two trape trapezium. Okay? We have this trapezium which starts from here up to this point, And this trapezium here. This. Okay? So, we can say... We can say distance is equals to 1 over 2 
A plus what? A plus B H. Am I right? Plus this is this is another trapezium here. Let's calculate distance at the same time. At the same time, why? It's still also one over two A plus B A H. Or if you want, you can find the distance of each shape here. This shape you can just cut here. You have a triangle and a rectangle, another rectangle. All together, we can just get this as the whole rectangle and the two triangles. We're still going to get the same answer. Okay? Okay, I will show you anyway. If you don't want to use it, the one for trapezium. So here, half, what is our A for up to this point? Eh? It's 10, eh? This is 10. Okay, let's get this one as 10. Our B is just this top part. From 5 to 10 is what? 5, eh? It's just 10 minus 5. So you can just write 5, 5. What is the height here? 10. Plus half, open bracket. You see, this trapezium here is just, uh, it's upside, it's like this. All together, it's like this. So you can say this one is your A or this one is your B or AB. Don't worry, right? Then this one becomes your height. Your height. Are we together? This can't be your height because you have this proportion. You have this side here. Let's say this one is your A. This one is your B. And this one your A, your H. So if you're confused with this, use what? The shapes that you know, already know. Are we, are we together? So if I were to get this one as our A, we're going to get 0 to 10, eh? 0 to 10, which is just the 10. 10. Are we together? Plus our B, 0 to 20, to get 12. 20. This is 20, eh? We get 20. What is our height? Our H, 10 to far, 15 is far? 5. Are we together? It is 3 ma. 3 marks, hi. Okay, here we can solve. Um, what is half of 10? What is 10 plus 5? So you have 15 here times 5. 5, eh? Plus. Okay, so half of this one is point, point, and this is paper only. You're not supposed to use a calculator. So just, let's just leave it. It's the way it is. 10 plus 20. 10 plus 20. 30, then 5 here. Okay. So this times this, 15 times 5, 75, right? Eh? Okay, because 5 times 5 is 25. So 5 carry 2, 5 times this one, 5 plus 2, 70 what? 7, eh? 70, so 75 here. What is half of 15? Oh, half of 30? 15 times 5? Same, why? 75, 75. 75 plus 75, eh? 150. So 150 meter, meters. So distance here is 1 feet, 150 meter, meters over 15 seconds. Are we together? Uh-huh. So it's easy. It's three marks, yes. So the job is here. Are we together? So 15 into 15, and this zero, meters per second. And this is the, uh, the answer. Now let me show you um, if you just want to use shapes, eh? Um, just apart from trapezium, you know, this one you, you know, you, you know that this is a trapezium, eh? Let's say this one you know as a trapezium. Now, this one is confusing to know where is A and where are supposed to put B, eh? And where are supposed to A, put A, H, okay? This side, you know, is 75. We've already calculated this side, 75, right? Let's calculate this. Let's split this one into, into two. Are we together? Into rectangle and the tri triangle. Are we together? Uh huh. So rectangle is A times B, right? Plus this one, half BH. Am I right? Mm hmm. So for re rectangle, let's say this one is A, right? And this one is B up to this point, right? So our A will be 5, right? Am I right? 5 times our B from here to here is 10, right? So 10 like this, then half. This triangle here, the H here, height 10 to 20 is what? 10, eh? 10 to 20 is 10. Then the B from here is 5, right? So 5, then 10. This time this one is what? 50, eh? 50 plus, what is half of 10? 5. 5 times 5? 50 times 
75 70 what 75 am i right 75 same as here 70 what 75 so this 75 you've found here add it to what you found here and you um you are good to go with the, this okay so this is how it's what it's in calculated are we together mm-hmm